Hey everyone, I'm in Farming Simulator 22 and here I'm going to show you how to keep bees, put them around your farm and how to get the honey and how to sell it. So it's going to take a little while um, but the principles are quite nice. So why should you keep bees? One, they're really easy to keep. Two, they're cute. And three, they can improve the yield of your farm. Uh, so your fields, they'll help you know, pollinate stuff and improve that yield a little bit. Um, and also made a honey that you can sell. So it's win, 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 really. Uh, they cost a bit of money to set up though. So let's talk about that and how we do it. You need to go to your build menu to create some hives or to build some hives. So you do that on the Xbox by hitting the little screens button, which is the one to the left of the main Xbox box light up logo uh, and then when you're on here LB so you get to this page here uh, and you want to pick construction and then when you're on construction use your d-pad to flick between these different areas and we want animals and then down to bees with the right d-pad and then you've got different options you can toe dip with just the hive if you want or you can have four or you can have an elongated hive or you can have 10 or you can have 33 I'm gonna go big baby and I'm gonna have 33. So then hit A to grab your hive. Now you can rotate the item around by LB or RB to rotate it the other way around and just stick it somewhere near fields. Don't really matter, they'll just buzz around and make you some honey. So I'm just gonna stick them there. So this is 19,000. So this is gonna be a fair bit of investment of stuff. Um, but like I say, there's some benefits to this. So let's hit A to stick the hives there and hit B to go back. I could apply more hives. Um, the other thing that you want to apply just while you're here is some place for the honey to be um, put, ready to be sent off elsewhere. So that's the, ha the uh, beehive honey palette location. So it's this little sort of uh, thing here. So I've gone right with the D-pad to select it. And then you can stick this wherever you want, um, but all of your... Uh, honey will then be sent here um, uh, for you to load up onto other things. Now this process of the bees making honey is going to take a little bit of time. If we go here we can see the little bees coming out. Look at them buzz, 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 buzz. Um, and while we're doing that we could go and get a transporter and I'll show you how you transport and sell your honey. Um, you can also use the honey in different things. I think there's different shops. I've not really got that uh, that far in the farming stuff now, but I do know how to sell the honey. So what we need to do is sort out some transport. So we're going to go off to buy some stuff in the shop. So I'll hit the, what one do I want? The screens button uh, and then LB up. And there's different things you can buy for transport. But if you go to the packs and click on transport, these are st some of the stuff that you can buy. We're obviously gonna need a, some sort of wagon to transport this stuff, so I'll buy this. Cool, well, well I'll lease it actually. I'm just gonna hit X to lease. Okay, hit back. I will get this one, I will lease this with X. Yep, okay. And the same with this one. Now slow down when you get to the tractor because if you miss something, you're gonna be annoyed because you can't apply this front loader to it without a special adjustment to the tractor before you lease it. So as we go to the tractor, hit A to customize, and then you need the front loader attacher. So I'm using the left stick to go down past wheel brand, wheel set up to the front loader attacher, and then I turn this on, which is an extra 1500. Hit X to lease, call, yes, super duper. Off we go to the shop. So. What I'm also gonna do is fast forward time a little bit. I'm gonna fast forward time. Uh, I don't know why I've done that like in a go cleaters type kind of action, I don't know. But we need to speed up time a bit for these honeys. These honeys? They're not honeys. These is bees, they make honeys. Honeys? I'm not sure they make honeys, they make the honey. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, so uh, right button to go through my vehicles on the D-pad until I get to the shop with my stuff. And then I'm just reversing back. So remember, I needed that special front loader attachment on my tractor, otherwise I can't attach this. And then I'm just driving forward into it and hitting A to attach it. Same here. Attach that. And it, I don't know why, when you attach that, it like does that. <laughs> so I hold down LB uh, and then left stick, sorry, right stick to the left, right stick down. So lift it up out of the way, so it's out of the way. Drive forwards, slap your trailer on. I'm using down on the D-pad just to zoom out a bit so I can see what I'm doing. And then we'll attach this. Okay, cool, we got some transport. So what should be happening is our little bees should be buzzy, buzzy, buzzy in and around. 
buzz, 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 going back to the hive, making us some honey, and then I don't know how the honey magically appears on our pallet, but it does, and that sits in the little pallet place that we put. So when we go back, I'm hopeful, hopeful we will have some honey, 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 honey. That's what we'll see. And like I say, you can build other stuff. I haven't got to it yet, but I think that utilizes honey on your farm. I ain't got a clue what. Maybe later, as I learn more about this marvelous game, I will know about these things. But I'm hoping, actually, I totally forgot to speed up time, didn't I? Because I was talking too much. Actually, that's a good point. So let's go back here. So you can see we have enough honey. This is not good. So let's try speeding up time. So hit the menu button and we're going to go down here. Right button, right button, right button until we go to here and whap up that time scale to 120 times. And then we're just going to, we're just going to stand here. We'll get out of the little old chatter and uh, wait for our bees. Oi, bees, I need some honey, my bee friends. Get out there, make the honey. Come back here, put the honey in the hive. And go, yeah, good bees. So if we look at this, we now have 17 liters of honey. Um, you can actually pick this up or, or some of this with your dude, but that's not a very sensible thing. And if you leave this, <coughs> you will gradually see more and more honey will appear on this pallet ready to load. So because time is of the essence, I know you're very busy people playing your game. <laughs> Uh, but I'm going to jump on my tractor here, jump on my tractor, and then I'll detach this back thing to make sure you're on the right tool. Have a little look just above the controls. You see there's a little picture of the tractor with a little white dot behind the tractor and in front of the tractor. You can select the different tools by hitting Y, but I want to make sure I've got the back one selected because I want to get the trailer off. And then when I've got that off, uh, sorry, I've selected, I hit detach by hitting A, get out of the way so I can use my tractor. So you can see... Because we got the time speeded up, them bees is making honey like it's going crazy. Um, which is cool. So we've got more honey there. So I could just leave it and they'll they'll build out. I'm not sure whether it'll max out at some point. Could well do. Um, but now we've got to get used to using the, um, the, uh, the fork and the lifter. So to do this, you hold down LB and um, R stick to go up and down and left and right to move the angle of it here. And you just got to sort of try and get it low on the floor like so, and lined up like that. Oh, that's marvelous. It's beautiful. If you need to adjust the width of your forks, you can do that by holding RB and then left, uh, right stick again, left and right until you get it just how you want it. And then go forward, my friends. Oh man, I'm so close. Oops, that's broke it. Hang on, what have I done? Let's zoom in a bit. I've gone underneath somehow. Oh, see, sometimes the camera angle would make sense to pick a different slight view. This is a bit of a dark art, this. Oh, man. Yeah. And then when you're there, lift it up, all right? And then... The physics on this game are quite, is quite impressive, so if you drive too fast, they will fly off of your pitchfork or your fork. So you want to take your time with this. Uh, and then you just go to your trailer and load it up. I'm just taking my time. I find this bizarrely... There, there was a good point there. You can't pour honey into your silo. Um, I think there's various areas you could store it. Probably in a hay barn would make sense. Um, if you want to do stuff on mass, um, I'm just taking my time here with a trailer. But what I quite like about honey is it's very passive. You don't have to do nothing really, apart from buy the honey, buy the honey, buy the bees, buy the hives. Get there in a minute. You can see I'm not the best at loading these things, but you get the idea. Ah. Sorry, we'll get there in a minute. What have I done? Oh, I'm too high up. There we go. We 
Did I let me do it? There we go. Right, we've done it. Okay, so we've got that all loaded. And then what we're going to do is I'm going to show you, I'm going to finish off showing you where you could sell this. Uh, so we'll zoom out a little bit. Load this back on. And we would take it off for sale. Now, one thing to bear in mind is when you've got the trailer, things can slide around. So you don't want to go too crazy doing this. But where do you sell it? It's the same place you sell most things. So if you hit the um, menu icon on your controller and then go right up until you find prices. And then you want to find honey and see who wants it. So there's a fast food restaurant, uh, Johnson's Farmer's Markets. And the fast food restaurant looks the best here. So we'll hit A and see where this is. So if I just come back out a little bit, uh, let's have a little look at the map. Where is that? Let's see. Oh, that's rather useful. It's just, just there, look. Just there, my friends. Whoa, right, so easiest, easiest travel ever. So we'll just drive our little tractor up. Tractor, tractor going to our fast food shop. Cool, man. So you got like a little unload bit? I don't know. It's a bit dark now. I forgot to turn off the fast forward. So I wonder if I can just, can I just do that? I can. There we go. We made 358 pounds from our harvest. That easy. From bees. So that 19,000 that we already banged out, we've already got 350 back. Um, job done. So just let me get back to daytime for you. We're just going to have a little nap in the house because <laughs> we can't see anything and then we will finish up oh man look it's raining it's all sorts of stuff hang on uh sleep yes sleep marvelous come on come on come on, come on. there we go and then you obviously may want to think about slowing down time again at some point uh so i'll just do that here slow that back down to Turn normal. There we go. And that's it. That's how bees work. So I hope that helps you keep bees and lets you add bees to the thing. Um, I've actually neglected my crop here because <laughs> we were looking at other things. But you can see I've got more honey there. Look, what have we got now? Another 120 litres of honey. That's ready to load. So I suppose the, the downside you've got, I wonder what happens whether we speed it up again, whether we'll get more honey or whether we've got to keep regularly moving it. Let's just see. Let's just wrap that up again. See what happens. I would think you've got to regularly come back here, otherwise you're not going to get honey sort of um, reloads. So I'll just check whether it goes any bigger. Doesn't look like it. So I might be wrong on that, but you may need to move it each time that that's full for it to continue filling up. Um, so that's something to keep an eye on. But I hope that was useful to you. If it was, give us a thumbs up, please. That's much appreciated. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this sort of stuff, have a little look at the rest of my channel. I've got all sorts of tutorials on Farming Simulator 22, adding new stuff regularly, and also many other games as well, like you'll find FIFA 22 and Forza Horizon 5 and all sorts of Xbox games. If you like what you see, please subscribe. Thanks so much.